imagine a situation where you do not have the OTP from your authenticator, you know, which will allow you to log in into the true NAS UI, just like me. So in this scenario, what you can do here is that you can go to your SSH access and run this command, which will then disable the two-factor authentication. And that is the reason why we do not recommend to enable the two-factor authentication for the SSH access during the two-factor authentication deployment for the first time. So once you do that, you can see here, it, ha it is disabling the two-factor authentication. And this was a secret code for the previous session with the two-factor authentication. Let's try to get back to our true NAS. And let's try to refresh this. So now you can see that there is no two-factor authentication tab. And you can successfully log into the TrueNAS UI and do all the changes. Thank you.